everybody and welcome to another educational video about screen printing by Catspit Productions. Alright, so today is just kind of another quick tips video and what I wanted to do was kind of explain the difference between a rear clamp screen printing press and a side clamp screen printing press, okay? And we're gonna have to use some visual aids for this today because I have a rear clamp. So we have that, but I'm gonna have to use a photograph to show you what a side clamp is. So let's take a moment and talk about the pros and cons or you know the advantages and disadvantages of having a rear clamp as opposed to a side clamp rotary manual screen printing press. Okay, so the difference between a rear clamp press and a side clamp press is very simple. This is a rear clamp press because the screen clamps down in the print head at the rear. Okay. Now, like I said, I don't have a side clamp press, but take a look at what it looks like in this image and you'll see that a side clamp press actually has some side arms that come out and grab the screen from either of the two sides. Okay, so what does that mean? What it means is that a side clamp press that has the clamps, you know, grabbing the screen here and here, means that you are limited to the size screen that you can put in the press. Okay, also in my opinion, the rear clamp press or the rear clamp print head is much sturdier because all you have to worry about actually is the rigidity of your frame. Okay, this sucker will not wiggle and tweak at all as long as your aluminum frame is welded properly and you know not like breaking. <laughs> if if an aluminum welded screen is moving and wiggling it's it's garbage. Okay, so the only thing you have to rely on for rigidity is the integrity of the screen itself rather than these kind of flimsy side clamps to me in my opinion okay the rear clamp is just superior because we can do this okay I can do that I can also do this my press I have my uh, pallets loose right now there's no indexer because I don't like to have it so it's wiggling around a little bit all right I mean literally the rear clamp press if you had some strange reason to do this, not that you would want to, because it wouldn't be as tight in the clamp, but I could do that too. Okay, so the rear clamp press, to me, is more dynamic. And the last thing that I'll mention is that you can put an oversized screen in the rear clamp press with a big pallet and print posters. So in other words, the screen can be as big as you want basically as long as there's no other screen in the next head. If there's a screen in the next head it can be as big as it is before the two screens hit here because at some point they're gonna hit right here. Okay so but if you're using one print head or every other print head in a rear clamp screen printing press I could theoretically use almost any size screen I want. A side clamp print head cannot do that. Okay, so that's my main that's my main thing. I prefer a rear clamp press because it's just I think it's more sturdy, rigid, better with registration, less parts. Okay, and uh, it is more dynamic in what I can do with the screen in the, in the thing. I can clamp it way over here. I can do whatever I want. I can put in a big screen. I can put in a tiny screen. I could put in any screen I want. Okay? Whereas a side clamp press, 
that may not be the scenario at all. Okay, so to me, that's the biggest difference between the side clamp and the rear clamp is basically the, the rear clamp is more sturdy in my opinion and much more flexible as far as what screens you can put in the printhead. For instance, you can use the standard 20 by 24 manual screen, right? Or if I need to go large, I could use a 23 by 31 in a rear clamp. Not a problem, okay? And again, I could do it this way, as you can see, or if for some reason I needed something wide, I could do it this way. And this is a, like I said, a 23 by 31 manual screen. So that is what I'm talking about with the rear clamp press. It's just more dynamic. It's just, you know, and I think sturdy. It's just way sturdier, way sturdier. All I have to worry about is that my screen is welded tight. That's it. And the clamp grip is snug. Not over tight, not monkey gripped, just snug. All right, that's all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was valuable to you. And uh, yeah, it's still hot here. I'm trying to uh, get through the monsoon season here. It's hot and humid. So I've closed down the uh, classes or the personal training, hopefully till September when maybe, uh, you know, things will get a little bit better. Uh, but it's been pretty rough in the shop here teaching students, very hot. And we even had some humidity problems with film sticking to the emulsion and stuff like that. Believe it or not, out here, you know, in the desert. So uh, monsoon season is definitely uh, trying and uh, it's, it's it, yeah, a little bit of humidity with this high heat is like crazy. So I'm gonna get back in the air conditioning before I fall apart here. <laughs> so thanks again for watching. I really appreciate your time and attention very much. And of course, if you like what you see, you know, rate thumbs up, leave a comment, and of course, subscribe to the YouTube channel. And if you need screen printing equipment or supplies, check out catspitscreenprintsupply.com. Thanks a lot for watching. We'll see you next time.